Ludacris's seventh album, Battle of the Sexes, debuts number one in sales, selling 137,000 physical copies in the first week. It includes his fifth number one single, Billboard single, How Low. Could this be Luda's best album yet? Boom! Pow! Bang! Doo, doo, doo. I picked up Luda's Bots album the weekend after it came out. It was more on a whim than anything. I wasn't sure what to expect. For a solo album it seemed a little collabby to me, but I'm a bit of an impulse buyer so I thought what the hell. I wanted to wait a while before I did this video, which turned out to be about two weeks longer than I intended, to make sure that I felt the same way as when I first heard the album. I can honestly say after a week of listening to this and listening through it about ten times in full, this is an amazing album. I'd say hands down the best album Ludus put out since Word of Mouth. I can safely say that this is probably one of my favorite albums I'll buy this year. Now that being said, Luda has, since he came out back in 2000, with Back for the First Time, been one of my favorite rappers. But the albums he's come out with since Word of Mouth have been somewhat disappointing. I would like some of the songs, but I couldn't really just throw the CD on and listen to the whole thing all the way through without skipping some of them. To be honest, I didn't even buy his last two albums. I borrowed them from friends and then decided against buying it myself which I don't normally do. I normally like to support artists that I like. Back on topic about the album, despite the fact that it may have the most songs that I could listen to repetitively, I wouldn't call it as best to date. Mostly because I can't see any of the songs on the album becoming classic tracks like What's Your Fantasy or Roll Out or possibly the most familiar song Move Bitch. But the CD is definitely worth picking up. It's typical Luda style with drinking and sex, fast cars, and pop news. You get 14 tracks plus one bonus filled with guest appearances. And don't let the guest list fool you. Luda rips it and he doesn't leave any leeway for failure by anybody else. The only downfall I had was what made me weary about the album in the first place. The high pitched voice in How Low. Luckily, it's only used in How Low and the remix of My Chick Bad. So, although it's better than Autotune, I still don't like it. Other than that, a very solid album, and I'd recommend it to anyone who hasn't got it, get it. This is me, and I'm out. You've been watching this guy and his point of view. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. I could go into more detail about the album, but really, it's a Luda album. If you like Luda's style and flow, go get the album.